Deutschland, nice. Uh, so, so if you think about how Northern Africa became Muslim, it was more through trade. Today, the biggest Muslim country is Indonesia. Not a single war, not a single fight. Indonesia, right? It was conquered. Indonesia right? was conquered. All. No, no. Let, let, let me let me let me ask you. Let me ask you something. And Hold on. Can I can you I ask you a question? Two different laws. Can I ask for you a question? For the Muslims and for the non-Muslims. No, we don't. And no, we don't. No, we don't. No, no, no. Texas that is wrong. That is wrong. We don't have no, two different laws. We have, we give Ahlul Dhimma their laws. You, we have the freedom. We give them. That is not true. The ummah and the rest. No, no. Who's the ummah? The ummah are all the Muslims. You, you know, you know what the ummah of of there is two types of ummah. One is ummah da'wah, which is all of mankind. When is Ummah Mustaba, the ones who accept? So, so you understand what the word Ummah is not just for Muslim, first thing. You know, no, no, let me explain it to you because we don't want to just talk, we want to understand. Let me explain. If you look at Indonesia, the biggest, um, um, the biggest Muslim country population-wise, yeah, yeah. go in history, not a single battle. Not a single battle. They were not it's conquered. Not it is true. Okay, okay, you go look it up. There were seafarers, listen, seafarers listen. from the Arabian Peninsula invading. Indonesia? Invading Indonesia. You, you know, um, I hate to say this, but, it's, it's, but you're it's wrong. It's the same. Can Bali, you look it up? Bali is the last Can... rest. Bali okay. is the last rest of the original religion of Indonesia. But, but through conversion, always, not through battle. It was always a danger. It was not through it's battle. It's always a danger for Bali. Let me, let Nowadays, me explain something to you. Look, it's always a danger. Look, let me ask you something. Go home. You have Google. Look it up. Okay? What, what do you mean? You have Google, internet. Yeah, yeah. Look up how Indonesia became Muslim. No, no, please. I'm, I'm just saying, if, if, if you want to know, I was I, I've been to Bali. I, I've, been, I've been to Jakarta, Bali I've been oppressed. to Bali, I've been to Indonesia many Bali a times. Let me explain something to you. If you've been to Bali, let me ask you something. Can, can a non-Muslim practice their religion or not? What do you mean? In Indonesia, yeah. if you're not Muslim, can you practice your religion? Not really. Really? Are you being honest now? I'm not really honest. Are you being honest? <laughs> what can you not do? I'm honest. They don't have temples? In, in the, like, in the, what what in can the, they the not near, do? In the Near East, there were uh, Christian people. But, but again, you're not answering years. my question. In the last few years. Uh, what did the Crusaders do? Example. What did the Crusaders the do? Years, what did the Spaniards do in they South were America? Back to the places where before Christianity was. So Christianity was in South, South America before the Spaniards? No. No, but in Spain, you, 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 Spain, you think you think Mexico we, was Christian we before Colombia? Before it was conquered what, what by did the Muslims. What, what did the we, Spaniards we do in, in the Americas? <laughs> what, what did the Spaniards do in Americas? You're in America now. In Americas, yeah. was there Christianity before yeah. the Spaniards? No, did they not no, force no. people to no. become Christian? They made the same. Did they did they force people or not? <laughs> so you're not answering sorry. my question. Sorry. You, sorry. you didn't answer which you cannot the, practice the Indonesia. Makes, what can a non-Muslim not practice in Indonesia? Well, name me one thing. Let me say one, one thing. sentence. The yeah, conquerors in, in South America, they made the same like the Muslims in Indonesia. Okay, the mistake you have is that Islam, let me explain it. Islam was not spread by force in Indonesia. Look it up in history. In Indonesia today, yeah. name me one practice a non-Muslim Indonesian cannot practice their religion. One practice. Islam is I'm coming. asking you for one practice they cannot practice. Islam you said, you said, they, you said, strong. Alhamdulillah, it is everywhere. But you not said everywhere, no, everywhere. No, no, everywhere. No, no, where where no, are Islam no, not coming up? In the countries. In Europe? Without, <laughs> 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 let, let me explain in, in something. Europe, in Europe, yeah, in Europe. For a short while. No, 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 no. In the next, the yeah, next, keep, keep in dreaming. The next few years. Uh -huh. the next Islam few will years, be the dominant religion there, come, inshallah. Going back to the places uh -huh. where they're coming from. Europeans are becoming Muslim. What are you going to send them no, back? No, no, no. Look at him. Look at him. I think. And then you tell me. I he's from Arizona. No, no. Where are you going to send him back to? The most, the most people in Europe are without any religion. Uh, I don't know. Statistically, I don't think so. But that could they be your opinion. Without but any it's okay. Religion. The fastest and growing religion in Europe is. Tried in the communist Europe yeah. to bring back the Christianity. It was I no understand. Chance. Catholics, no I, I agree no with chance. you. I, because Catholicism is false. 
but Islam is truth. <laughs> so it's the fastest growing religion in Europe. Go Google it. Now, I, I'll just ask you one okay. question. I listen to you. Can yeah. you answer one question? You said non-Muslims in Indonesia cannot practice the religion. Yeah. Can you tell me one practice that they cannot practice? Just one. It's by law Yes. that Islam is the obligating religion in Indonesia. That is wrong. That is false. You're, you're, you're told a lie. I'm sorry. Then it's Saudi I've Arabia. been to Indonesia. Saudi Arabia is look, look, I asked about Indonesia and you're not answering. You're not answering me. Except, be honest. Be honest with me. Look, I'm okay. being honest with you. Except I, name Bali. one practice that a non-Muslim in Jakarta, forget Bali, a non-Muslim or Bali cannot practice from their religion in Indonesia. One practice. One. I Just think, one. I Just one. It's better than in Saudi Arabia. Look, I didn't ask you if it's better. I asked you Name one practice a non-Muslim Indonesian cannot practice in Indonesia. One practice of the religion. Name one. You cannot. I think you it's cannot. better. It's you a cannot. better place. I, 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 it doesn't matter if they're better or worse. I'm just asking. You said mm -hmm. that non-Muslim Indonesians cannot practice the religion in Indonesia. I'm asking you what religious practice can a non-Muslim Indonesian not practice in Indonesia? Just name me one practice. I think Bali ex you is, cannot. is the example that they can... Jakarta. Yeah. Ask any, any place in Indonesia, it doesn't matter. Name one practice. You cannot. You cannot because that was a I false statement. No, no, no. Don't give, give me another way. example. Answer this example first, please. We Look, were I, we, we're going to be honest, right? Uh, we are, we're, we're being honest, right? Honest. Honest. honest I give you another, they, they, they just another, admit another one example. thing. Okay, I uh, will move to your example. One, one. Admit one thing first. Turkey. Admit one thing. That you cannot name one non-Muslim Indonesian practice that they cannot practice the religion. You cannot name okay. one. I will, Just I will, admit I will that and we'll move to another question. No, no. First if answer this one. Real, I'm not going to jump. I'm not going to jump. I'm not going to jump until you finish this one. Admit first. Now, if you don't admit, I'm not just going to jump here and jump to Turkey okay, and Saudi and this. Give you the answer. No, no. At the ahead. moment, mm -hmm. at the moment, Indonesia, at one the practice. Moment, yes. At the moment. Okay. I don't know the future. Okay. But at the moment, it could be possible that you can practice another religion in Indonesia except of Islam. Thank you. <laughs> he admitted it. His statement was false. Yeah. He admitted. No, no. Let, let's just at stop. The moment, let's just stop. At the moment. At the moment. At the. I don't know the future either. But let's admit but, that yeah, I'll shake your wrist. You see that you your see, statement was false. Another, another, it was right. Another argument. It was false, right? If you, if you, was it false or not? <laughs> if you're influenced by the Quran, if mm -hmm. you are a real Muslim, okay. If you are feeling that's your religion, mm -hmm. and you, it's not only for the brain. Okay. It's the Western thinking of religion. It's a kind of living. Okay, I'm with you so and far. For us, it's not a kind of living religion. Okay. Religion is for the personal brain. You're thinking, as a kind of living, it's different from religion. That's You've lost me. So thinking in the West. But okay, you, uh, so, so you mean a separation Muslim, between separation between Muslim, church and state, or yeah, what yeah, do you mean? Separation. Okay. It's by the Romans. It's by the Romans. Okay. And uh, the Roman Empire was a Christian empire. They were dividing, give to, to the emperor what the emperor is, and the rest is for you. Right, right. And but Caesar is for when, Caesar, but, and yeah. yeah. But when you are a real Muslim, okay. you can't. I agree with you. Difference. I agree with you. you I'm can't with you. Make a difference. Okay, you I'm with you. Live, yes, you and, have to live by the Quran. The, Allah subhanahu wa taala says in, in the Quran in Surah Al Kafirun. Here, yeah. I'll, I'll even read it for you from in English if you I like. Have, I, I've, I've read it in German. I have it in okay. German. So have you read Surah Kafirun? I have, I have read just the chapters belonging to the wives. Yeah, that's a problem. <laughs> you, you, you're only worried about the wives. You should worry about the whole Quran, right? <laughs> yeah. So if you look at Surat Al-Kafirun in the Quran. Yeah. Okay. yeah. Here. Say, O disbelievers, yeah. I do not worship what you worship, nor are, are you worshippers of what I worship, nor will I worship what you worship, nor will you worship what I worship. For you is your religion and for me is my religion. What a beautiful statement. You see, you see, if you had read the Quran, no, no, let, let, let me say something now. Yeah. If you had read the Quran, you would have known what you're saying is wrong. We can accept other people to have other religion. We in Islam do not believe in force. Can, can I finish now? Let, let me finish. Can I, I let you finish, you let me finish. If you had read the Quran, you would have known that the, that the negative stereotypes fed to you by the media are wrong. And Islam, we do believe that people have the right to their religions. Yeah. Islam tells you, you cannot force somebody to become a Muslim. That's why when you said you have two laws, the mistake you're making is, Quran tells us, and the Prophet Muhammad told us, 
that when non-Muslims live in your country, let them live by their laws, Ahlul Dhimma. And an we example. pay zakat. We pay zakat. I give you an example. To, go ahead. Because maybe this is a theory. This maybe, is what? Maybe this is a theory. Theory. A theory? No, no, this is a verse in the Quran. It's not a theory. This is Surat al Kafirun. Egypt, Egypt, look, look, Egypt let me... was a country totally okay. Christianity. Sure, sure. And then was an, an Arab invasion. No. Arab invasion, let me, let me, historically. Arab invasion, who, who invaded uh, Egypt? Tell me. In the name of the person. The Arabs brought the Arabian language to Egypt. Okay. And that there, it? Are, okay. there are 10% okay. of the Egyptians are speaking the original Egyptian Coptic language. language. Yeah. Sure. The original Egypt, sure. And the original. Christian, Christians, mm -hmm. sure. like in further days, hundred percent. Feel free. Like in further days, hundred percent. Mm. And this, Pasa de Halko and this minority uh -huh. is now totally oppressed. Okay, let me let me it's tell you totally something. Oppressed. Can, can I answer now? It's totally oppressed. See, I listen to you, right, respectfully. Now, Egypt in the time of Amr ibn As, he is the one that went there. Nobody was forced historically. Google this. No, look it up. I'm telling you, look it up. Salahuddin Ayyubi, Salahuddin, he ruled Palestine, Jews were able to practice, Christians were able to practice, Muslims were able to practice. When the, they were not, Salahuddin, in Salahuddin's time, there was, no, Salahuddin Ayyubi. It was, Look, you be have, historic. have two different texts, that was the problem. Okay, let me explain that to you. Let me explain it. Let me you tell know you. This. I you do. Know the I fact. do. I, I, I will tell you the fact. You have, you have I, 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 I will tell you. Not more. That is not true. More. Let me explain you have, it. You have to pay Look, tax I'm a Muslim. I'm a Muslim. Let me explain it to you. Okay. Muslims have to pay zakat. Zakat is an obligatory trust for our religion yeah. that we pay that goes to a thing called Baytul Mal. But it's let, let me. Can it's I explain? Evil. Can I explain it? No. Under a Muslim government, you as a Muslim have to pay it. Yeah, but it's a free will, and I think in the, in, Again, in the Quran it's a free will. No, as a Muslim, to give it to the no, poor. no, two point five percent of your wealth. See, you should learn before you speak. So I'm trying to explain it to you, so hopefully we can have a conversation. As a Muslim, I have to pay that into zakat al mal. Okay? So that goes to social welfare, helping the needy, helping the, the people traveling through and those kinds of people. As a Muslim, I have to. Now, as a Muslim government, I can't tax you. Okay, so as a Muslim, I pay zakat that goes to the government. If they use it for the, the thing Quran has told for zakat to be paid out. As a Christian living under the Muslim land, I cannot force my religion on you. I cannot force, can, can I finish? I'm telling you about it, I'm going to tell you. Don't think I don't know about this, I've studied this, okay. As a Muslim government, I cannot tell you pay zakat. Why zakat is a religious duty. And as a Muslim, I have to respect that you have a different religion. So now when you use the government functions, you have to pay what's called jazia. And jazia is for using the streets, using security, using in the time of the Prophet Muhammad, Muhammad and his companions, if the government could not give the Christians those securities, they could not take jizya from them. It's not a non-Muslim tax. But if you're using, like you, you live in Germany, you pay taxes, right? Yeah. Right? Yeah. So just like that, as a Muslim, I pay zakat. As a non-Muslim, you pay jizya for the government to run and give you services. How is that not fair? In Spain, and, and, and zakat can be more than jizya, depending on your wealth. It's a Spanish did, did, population. You, did, did you understand my answer first? Yeah, wait, wait, no, no, I'm, I'm not going to jump around. Did but you understand? You another, another but do you understand example. the concept of, of jizya? I give you an under, did you understand it or not? I have understood. Good. But I give you an example Go ahead. that in history it was Go ahead. totally the opposite. Okay, let's ask you about Spain first. Andalus, Spain, yeah. under Moors, yeah. were Christians allowed to practice? But that yes or no? That, that didn't yeah, yes want or no? To have I'm an asking Islamic you a question. Government. Sure. Was, I may not want Trump's government. <laughs> I don't want Trump, but it's not my choice. But <laughs> he took a, it by power. <laughs> yeah, Trump's a conqueror. He didn't no, get elected. No, no, Hillary Arabs, Clinton. Hillary Clinton got more the Arabs votes. Were conquering. <laughs> okay. You see, let me ask you something. Let me ask you. Let me ask you something. Hold on. Let me ask you something. Just the last sentence. Okay. The Crusaders. I'm going to listen to you. The Crusaders were coming back to their original country. Really. So those Europeans were originally from Palestine? Yeah. Richard the Lionheart was from Palestine? The problem was... Yeah, no, 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 wait, wait, wait. I'm sorry, wait. Palestine, are you saying, the Holy Land, are you saying that those Europeans from France 
and yeah, England were originally from there? No, they were okay. no Arabs. No, no, no. They were Arabs in that land, the Ghassani, no, no, Ghassani no, tribe. No, no. Look up, look in up Roman the Ghassan. Times, there were no, no I'm sorry. Arabs in, this in the Bible, there's mention of the Arabs of no, during the Roman no, times. No, 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 look, look. Let no. me let me explain something. Let me explain something. Can I? Can I, explain can it I to speak? You. Yes, just one okay. sentence. I'm listening to you. It's a history. That's been a long it's a sentence. Truth of history. Okay. That in Roman times, the Arabs were just in the place of Saudi Arabia. First thing, and, there was no such thing as Saudi Arabia. They were always defending okay. this place against the Arabs. First thing, let me explain something to you. Now, let me, I listen to you, right? There's no such thing as Saudi Arabia at that time. Saudi Arabia came way later. The Jazeera al Arab includes what's called Sham. Sham has a tribe called Ghassan. I want you to go home and look at them up. Ghassan is a tribe that before Islam were Christian, Arabs, that lived in Palestine. For, look them up, please. Look, look, if you don't believe me, Go home, it's wrong. you have the internet, it's look wrong. up Ghassan tribe. I'm sorry. Look it up. I'm sorry. Have you looked it up? I'm sorry. You, so you, you're being close minded, right? Just you, You're being close minded. You're Just not even going to look it up? I'm can you look it up? Sorry, I'm historian. Historian, then can you tell Just me who are the Ghassan tribe? Just uh, okay. You're a historian, can you tell me who are the Ghassan you, tribe? You, you know, maybe As you a know. historian, I'm asking you, do you know who the Ghassan another, tribe? Another, Again, you're not answering me. Give you you're another, not answering another, me. Please. Do you know this that is not the Arabian a tribes were taking over the true religion? What do you mean by that? getting Muslims. What does that mean? Uh, several Arabian tribes, uh -huh. they were taking over the true religion. Taking religious. over or converting? Converting oh. to the true religion. Okay. Before sure. they were Muslims. Sure. I know that. There were, there were Arabian Jews. But no, what does that have to do anything? No, no, not Arabian Jews. There were Arabian tribes. Okay, living, they became living, Jewish. Living near, near to Mecca. Before yes, Muhammad in, in Medina. In Medina, there were Medina, Jews. Before yeah. Muhammad came. Yes, I know. And they were Jews. Uh, I know. I've taught this. I taught the life of the but Prophet. In, in, in Palestine, there were no Arabs. Okay. In the Roman uh, again, time, no. again, in the Roman again. Time, no. As a historian, no. No. can you just tell me who is the Ghassan tribe? Never heard. Okay, so can Just you go? Maybe. Can you go look it up? <laughs> can you go look it up and come back to me, or are you going to be close-minded? I'm not more close-minded cool. than you. No, you, you are. Sure. You are. You no, are. No, because no, I'm no. willing to look it up, no, and you're not. No. no. Yeah, yeah. I, 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 I'm asking you as a historian. Go home, get yeah. your history books, look up the Ghassan tribe. Arabs who lived in Palestine before Islam. The Roman. Go look it up during the Roman the time. The Roman history is my special field. Excellent. Then, then you must know the Ghassan tribe. No. Then you're probably not a historian. No. no. <laughs> Do you teach history? I'm sorry. I'm Do you sorry. teach history? Yeah. Where? In. <laughs> Gorlitz? Is that in a. Gorlitz. Is that a university or is that a yeah. city? There's a city at both. I'm sorry, so there's a university called Gorlitz? Yeah. And in, you're. In a city, in a city in Germany. Okay, so what's the name of the university? University of Gorlitz. Okay, that's pretty easy. So you teach history there? Yeah. Roman history? And Roman is my special field. And you've never heard of Ghassan tribe? And you can trust me. I'm afraid for your students. Yes, oh, no. you see, history is for some people. It's uh -huh. history a possibility to project. No, no, this history should be documented. No, no, history should be and documented, right? And, and this is the problem. So this is sad that you're teaching history you've never even heard of the Ghassan tribe. I, I'm really sad not for your students. Roman, and not in the Roman okay. territory. So do this, not do this. Roman listen, listen, listen. You listen, know Herodes. Listen. Look, I'm, I'm asking you. know Herodes, you know Tiberius. Sure. Let me ask you, let me ask you to do one thing you can, as you an open-minded person, yeah. okay? Go home. Look up Ghassan yeah. tribe. Yeah. And then when you find the Roman historic documentation about their alliance with the Ghassan yeah, yes, tribe, no. then I'm you can sorry. call and, and apologize to me. I give you. Thank you so much. I, I give you. I appreciate your, your time. You are not a student of me. Uh -huh. I'm not. I, can I am so advice. glad. Because <laughs> if I was, advice. I wouldn't know the Ghassan it's, tribe and the Romans. It's, 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 not, it's, not, a, it's not a question I'll of religion. I'll take your advice. I'm listening. It's not a question of religion. Sure, it's not. It's a question of facts. Yes, exactly. So can you look up the Ghassan tribe? You know what? I'm, I'm going to look it up for you. No, okay. it's, it's not necessary. I will, I, will, oh, yeah. I will have a look in the internet. Okay, but excellent. Yeah, are you Ghassan Arab? tribe. Are you I am not. You are from? I'm Pashtun. Pashtun? Yes. And uh, are the Pashtuns belonging to the uh, Indo-European? Yes, we're Aryans. Like you. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Should we do the Heil Hitler now? <laughs> <laughs>
in, in, in the USA it's possible to bake this in Germany. Yeah, in Germany, yeah, yeah exactly. Fine, you know? I know. I know. I was in Germany. I was oh, yeah. in Austria. Oh, yeah. uh, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. I like Germany. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Me too. Excellent. <laughs> How do you like San Diego? It's nice. The yeah, weather's nice. The weather is nice. It's getting a little chilly today, but yeah. But is it is it not a problem this close as in San Diego? No, I love it. It's comfortable. Because uh, in Germany you see a lot of mm -hmm. Muslim people with the closest. Right. But here not. Yeah, not as many Muslims here, so. Many. Yeah. yeah. But it's, for me, I can for dress Germany. like that. I can. It doesn't matter. As a Muslim, I can dress any way as long as it's, it's an American Islamic. freedom. Yeah. End of the free. Yeah. <laughs> kind of. Yeah. <laughs> All right.